everyone. I'm here with Chris from Bamboo Projects, awesome organisation. This trailer, mate, we're able to manage to get you some money from the Stronger Communities Grant to, to get it going. It's a reality. We're standing here right in front of it. It's awesome. Yeah, we finally got it. So we needed a bigger trailer and we're hitting everyone up. So we appreciate the... Um the effort you went through to help us go through all the guidelines and that to get the grant. So that was amazing. And thanks to the taxpayers who, um, <laughs> this is where your money's going. 100%. We'll always remember it's the taxpayers' money. Yeah. So, mate, the great thing about it is, it, it uh, tell us a bit about it, what it was so needed for, because um, uh, obviously it's to help people who are on the NDIS program, yeah. get them out and about. Yep. So we do NDIS, we're also a registered charity, and it was about work programs and stuff like that to give people money. So... We collect 10 cent cans and bottles, Yep. and with that, they get the money. So 100% of the money goes to them and funding projects in the charity. So we do waterway cleanups, um, which is another project we got um, funded by Luke Health with yep. a, a boat. So that yep. gets us out cleaning up all the environment. So with this, we um, pull up to a caravan park. It's got um, easy access down the back here. Yep. Put a nice little ramp there. Um, jump up. All these bins are empty, so if someone's got a full bin, we switch them over, so we'll drop an empty one off. Yep. And then we'll take the full one, we go to the return it's, um, and then they help process them, and then we also teach them a little bit about sort of the business side of things, like how much a bin costs. So if they want to do it themselves, we encourage them, get yourself a bin, ask your neighbours, go collect them, because the bin's between, you know, anywhere between 15 and 20 bucks. Yep. So they're asking their neighbours, that's extra money they can get. And it doesn't affect their pension because it's classed as a hobby, from what I understand. But yep. 15, 20 bucks a week a month to someone on a disability pension is huge, you know, because yeah. I've spoke to a lot of people and this is why we love this work. They're, they're missing meals sometimes. Yeah. So I was thinking, what could we come up with with a way to get them work, engage in the community yep. and give them that sense of connection? And that's why we, we started this work program and this will hold 21 bins. So that's awesome because it saves us on fuel because it's getting pretty busy now. Yeah. Um, so we're out in the community. So anyone that wants a bin, we can even leave them at their house. Mate, that's so good. And look, it takes a lot of boxes because what we've got here is we've got people that would struggle to find a job in the open market. Yep. And you're helping these people out. They're on a pension. It's given that few extra dollars in this cost of living crisis that we're all suffering at the moment. So this is probably one of the best spend of taxpayer dollars that I've seen. So good on you, Chris. You're Thanks a champion, you. mate. Good no man. Worries.